Yo, 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 cameraman, right here, right here. Tip a little bit. There you go. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Woo! Specky J's Blanchard has arrived at the Omni. <laughs> How did you like that? Spec Dust promo right there. Much props and shout out to you, Spec Dust. That awesome promo not too long ago about yours truly, Specky James Blanchard, proud member, connoisseur of the In Your Head Horseman. <laughs> you know, in this promo, this final promo, in this luxurious, this awesome palace known as the Horseman Dressing Room, down in Studio J, in the Omni. A little lower left tilt where the Atlanta Hawks are stationed. It just so happens that the In Your Head Horseman has the <laughs> luxurious, awesome seats in the beautiful Omni right next to the executive offices of that franchise. <laughs> you know, I'm going to apologize for being late. Same thing as Jason X, Double X said a little earlier in his promo right next to me. Hey, we just flew in. <laughs> Had to keep the Rolex going. <laughs> the brides coming our way. <laughs> we had a whole lot of stuff to do going down to Las Vegas not too long ago. And as you can see, my Montreal Expos had on. We were in Montreal last night just kicking it and jobbing back and forth. But right now, <laughs> we're in Omni. And all fun and games are over with. Because this is the finals the famous, the first of his kind, Buckout Stampede. And I can't begin to tell every one of you how much I've been waiting for this moment. I knew, Double X knew it, that this was our time and our chance to shine. You see, not so often do you get two horsemen of our caliber into a setting like this where all the money, all the gold, the rubies, the medallions, the emeralds, everything that we all like and enjoy as horsemen will be on the line in the form of lettuce and money. And money that we will get tonight in the army. I haven't slept for weeks. And it's not just because of the party, the endless party, the, e and the endless conniving around very luxurious places that the horsemen do all the time. I've been thinking, and I've been pressuring myself to do what it takes to grab that money at the end of this tournament. The finals in your house, because of Peter's War, it just and just going around different areas of the country and the world saying that you did it. It's about flashing that money. Wearing beautiful Rolexes like that. Get a pan right there, kid. You see that? That beautiful Rolex right there. It's real. It's more than just this. It's the notoriety. And the visual. Because people know you are the best when you have that cash in hand. And this is what this is all about. Crystal, you're a good girl. You're wonderful, spectacular. But you are not horseman material, and you do not have what it takes to beat a couple of guys like us. Sweetheart, if you want a ride, we can give it to you. We can give it to you horseman style. Either in the hotel room, or over the top rope. Either way, we're going to come for you. Santo Loco, <laughs> my good friend, my good pal, you know, my good friend, Big Son, he likes the secluded paradise, does it all the time, we may do an episode on you, <laughs> the rise and the fall <laughs> of El Santo Loco, <laughs> I can see it right now, and Tazo the Greek, I thought we put it into you, <laughs> I thought we finished you for good, but it doesn't look like we get the job done. This time we will get it done. Horseman way. Because with Double X and myself, it only takes one of us, really. But with two of us, you are history. 
That beating we put on you several weeks ago will pale in comparison to what we do to you in the army tonight. Nikhil and all the rest of you who I haven't mentioned just yet, Dwayne, President Clinton, all of you are going to go down tonight. Because we're horsemen. That's how we roll. That's what we do. You should know that by now. And yes, I'm putting up, putting this promo together a little bit late. But I just want you people to understand what's going to happen tonight. Not only will we be victorious tonight, but we're gonna walk around, we're gonna walk out of the Omni as champions. As people, sole possession of the gold trophies. That we, we love that. Changed man. <laughs> You're a good friend of mine. We've done some really good stuff together in the past. And you just watch your back. <laughs> you like to beat up kitties. <laughs> you like to beat up kittens. You like to hang them. <sighs> it's going to be Pet cemetery for your ass tonight. <laughs> and Playboy Dub. You know, kid, you're old school. I like you a whole lot. You know, you are, you, you are horseman material. <sighs> but it's not official. Because it's not official, you're gonna be one of my enemies too. You can't fast talk your way out of this one. <laughs> but the right, but the right sum of money, <laughs> we may allow you to walk out of that building <laughs> without getting hurt. And all the rest of you, take heed, take heed of what the horseman can do. Take heed. But all those fans will witness tonight. In your head, horse. Supreme. And uh, the only thing we really do know is success. And when we beat you up, carve you, chew you out, spit you out, and leave you for nothing, it's either going to be Jason X or myself that will stand victorious. Jason will still be the world's television champion. I'm still going to be the United States heavyweight champion. <laughs> and I believe, from what I've, he what I've heard, the IWH, <laughs> the International Wrestling Alliance, has told the IYHWA that there will be a unification of the World's Heavyweight Championship at the next Carroll Crockett Cup Tournament. I can't believe it. That's what I hear from various sources. So we are looking to obtain the world's heavyweight championship unification style. No one holds either championship, and we're looking to combine both the IWA, International Wrestling Alliance, and then the In Your Head Wrestling Association. The championships are coming to the horsemen, the money. We have already got two titles. We're going to get some money tonight. And coming up at the next Carol Crockett Cup, from what I hear, the undisputed World's Heavyweight Championship is going to be on the line. And I'm looking to get that too. We all are. So, you peeps and peepettes of the Headyverse, I am Specky James Blanchard. And when the night is over, I'm going to be, or Jason X is going to be, double X, your rightful winners <laughs> of the one and only Buckhouse Al Stampede. Now, cameraman, I gave you the opportunity to interview me. Now I'm going to give you the opportunity to get the hell out of my dressing room. Bounce, bitch!